How's it going everyone? So welcome to Double Pebble. Now this is a review video. So today we will be looking at a 06U Botmer. I'm not sure if that's how his name is pronounced. Botmer, Botme, but whatever. So let's look at his stats first. Now Botmer is somebody that is um, like a hidden gem, you know. Other than this season, none of his other seasons are uh, lookable. So a lot of players have uh, requested me to review him so let's look at his stats now Botmer is obviously famous for his height 190 and uh, 90 freaking kg okay um, his best position is center midfielder so let's let's take a look now he's got good stamina so that's important for a midfielder uh, dribbling is okay 79 ball control is decent 85 tackling is uh, surprisingly subpar 77 Short passing is expected to be good, okay, 84, good finishing is not so good uh, Long passing is 82, not the best but we are serviceable Long shot interception, positioning is 79, okay uh, Vision is 87, that's not bad, reaction is 85 So, um, looking at his, his stats, right, he doesn't seem to really stand out a lot uh, something like 06U Delossi, the stats like not, really not so nice but uh, I've heard really good reviews for him like like not formal reviews like people are telling me that he's a beast he's fantastic and stuff in fact uh, one of my club mate actually has a plus 5 botmer so we're gonna take a look at him in game later on uh, his traits oh he got 11 traits that is good uh, he's a leader obviously um, he's a midfield master, he's a defending master, he's a playmaker, driven master Okay, so he's a more defensive sort of midfielder He's a, a long shot specialist as well, he's a tackle master So he kind of balances out his uh, relatively low tackling, I think 79 tackling Tactician as well, acrobatic, so we won't, we, we are not expecting uh, a 190 CM player to, have, to be an acrobatic But he is, and then He's a tanker obviously and he's a wing player and he's an area control okay so he's he should be a physical specimen and uh we hope that he'll be able to dominate the midfield in terms of price his uh monthly average is 49 million now is 59 million is just a slight increase um we will see in game later and uh, to, to find out whether he is worth 59 million that is to be honest not very expensive by today's standard so let's go into his in-game highlights now okay so let's talk about his actual in-game performance okay now uh first things first botmer is absolutely physically dominating okay he's 190 cm very tall uh, not a lot of high he will not lose a lot of high balls uh, which is useful and uh his size is also good for shielding the ball uh, you know when you are midfield sometimes you have to change direction his size will come in handy okay because his agility is quite low so he will be able to use his body to block off defenders um, his height will also come in useful and uh, at corners when whether he's attacking or he's defending corners and um, surprisingly like 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 D Rossi, his uh, tackling is actually pretty good. I think it's because of the trait, his tackle master trait. So even though his tackling is only 79, but uh, his tackle master trait really made up for it. So he really win, uh, won a lot of balls for me and I um, kind of like that for a center mid. Uh, he's slightly more defensive for a midfielder because he's a, a defending master rather than attacking master okay so if you are the type that prefer a more defensive kind of center mids he's the one to go for uh, passing is respectable i would say it's not really bad but it's also not uh like iniesta kind of fantastic it's somewhere in the middle which is uh, serviceable for that kind of price a uh, positioning seems to be good as well he he seemed to always be there when i need him and uh he kind of kind of uh when i'm attacking i always sign, kind of find uh, tend to find him right at the edge of the penalty box for my wingers to cut back so that's useful as well uh another thing is um he's obviously an offensive threat for high balls meaning to say uh let's say i'm i'm crossing right because you know your seat your midfielder sometimes will overlap your strikers uh i had an instant which was captured in the video as well that uh when i cross he happens to be the one that uh, I'm crossing to and he had no problem scoring from there because of his height and his obviously aerial threat. 
surprisingly his uh, fitness shot is uh, very very good now uh, I'm not sure is this because of him or is this because of the recent engine update that uh, buff up all the uh, fitness shot or is a combination of both I'm not sure but he scored I think like three fitness shot for me now like, even my Gerard uh, my world best Gerard when I use him I haven't scored a lot of fitness shot with him so I'm not sure this is down, due to him but he really scored quite a few fitness shot for me okay now let's uh, move on to his weakness he can actually feel a little bit clunky because of his height and size obviously you know players like PK players like Matic they all feel a little bit clunky because of their big size so uh, Botmer is no uh, except exception to this as well so if you are using him to turn a lot um, you might have a little bit of problem because he's not a fantastic dribbler so I've tried dribbling with him a few times but he just feels so stiff uh, resulting in the turn of possession so uh, for Botmer users you just you might want to take note just keep it simple with him spreads the ball around try not to dribble and turn with him okay um, a little tip here I think that uh, Botmer will be very good for a 3-man midfield, a defensive mid and 2 centre midfielders. You can pair him with probably a uh, Gerard or a Pogba, you know, more offensive midfielders and you will give your midfield really good balance, you know, you have a, def a more defensive central mid, you have a more offensive centre mid and you have a defensive mid. I just feel that this kind of configuration is really suitable for Botmer, okay? and um. Overall, I would rate him about an 8 over 10, 8 out of 10 because of his uh, clunkiness. But uh, he is a very decent player and at 59 million currently, I would say uh, if I'm using a 3-man midfield, yes, I would get him to partner my more offensive midfielder because um, he obviously have very good physical traits and I like a more physical midfielder. Alright, so 59 million, yes, I think it's worth it. So with that, uh, I'll end this video and I hope that you guys uh, find my review on Botmer useful. And don't forget to drop a comment, don't forget to sh uh, subscribe, okay? Don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to share uh, and like this video. And I'll see you next time.